I see a big future for you. Hold him firmly. If you're not careful, we'll go for the eyes. The eyes? Windows to the soul. Looks like just another unfortunate crow to me. What we have here is a gatekeeper. An escort. A donor. And the instrument to silence our wayward friend. Judge Morrison. Don't be afraid, little birdie. This'll just be a surface scratch. Don't you want to drain him like we did the others? No, we only need a small amount of his blood. That's enough. Now we've got everything we need. I love a good resurrection. So let's go raise ourselves a crow. People once believed that when someone dies, a crow carries their soul to the land of the dead. But sometimes something so bad happens that a terrible sadness is carried with it, and the soul can't rest. Then sometimes, just sometimes, the crow can bring the soul back to put things right. Things can never be right. My soul will never rest until we are together again. Today, one dollar steaming hot wiener. You looking or buying? I don't know. Yeah, well, when you figure it out, let me know. I'll alert the meeting. I've seen you. Lots of people seen me. I hit two dozen places every day. No, not the food. I used to run a pawn shop. What happened? I had a bad experience with a customer one night, got out of the business. Tell me where you got this strap, punk. I gave you this ring. How <laughs> much for this one? You're really starting to get on my nerves, man. Your pawn thing is all about taking something away from somebody. You sell them something to eat, you're giving them something. So that's my life story. Got a special on hot dogs. Buck a piece. It's been a long time. They're not that special, man. One buck. Yo, pal. You need it, you pay for it. Thanks. God bless. So, some guys vandalized the grave. You give it to Cap Show. Uh, it's Eric Draven's grave. I figure it's an OJ kind of a thing. Somebody thinks he got away with murdering his girlfriend. I'm trying to make a point. Yeah. Well, I'll drop by. Okay, but listen, Albrecht, with your history here, let's try to stay within the margins, okay? Judge Morrison? Detective Albrecht. 
I saw you testify at Draven's trial. So you're taking an interest in a man's grave now? The blood. <laughs> There's gonna be a lot more of that spilled soon. Like mine. Somebody wants to kill you? For releasing Draven? No. Tip of the iceberg. But everyone who's seen the big picture is gonna die. The big picture? Detective, I'm gonna make things simple. All the talking I do will be before a grand jury. I want immunity, and I want to go into protective custody immediately. The DA is going to want you to tell your story to his people first. <laughs> no way. Are you even listening to me, detective? I am a state judge. I am in control here. You are not. Funny, you don't look like a man in control. We don't want to be here. Let's go before it gets dark. Matter of time now, JT. And with my new body, I have plenty of that. I haven't looked this good since I was in the service. Almost died on Omaha Beach. Now that would have been a shame, denying me this glory in my old age. You look pretty good for 85. 87, actually. Not that it matters now. Thank you. <laughs> what do the kids call this, JT? Buff? Yes, sir. Okay, we're gonna start with some deep stretching now, Mr. Balsam. It's very good for people your age. Hmm. James, did you ever hear the expression, youth is wasted on the young? Is that from a movie? What would you say if I told you that you had been selected as my personal trainer, specifically because of your genes and your family history of longevity and health? Well, I guess I'd be, I don't know, happy, I suppose. Have you any last words? I don't know what you're talking about. And those will have to do. Oh. Don't, don't hurt the body. The bait moves. So what's that mean? never seen anyone come out of the light. Someone sent me. Might have been God. You've seen God? You don't actually see him. He could be a lady or a whole bunch of people. I don't know. What's it like in the light? It's like being at home again. But totally cool. Anyway, I have a message. Well, like a question, I think. What is it? If Eric needed you, would you go back and help him? Of course I would. Is it possible? How? It's sort of a secret. Please tell me. 
Can we split in two so it stays a secret? You have to say goodbye to Eric. Why do I have to do that? I'm not the boss to heaven. Listen, thanks for letting me use your place. Anyway, you want. Albrecht, just how long are you letting me rot here? The DA will want to know what you're selling before they talk immunity. I don't get it. I don't talk. Well, you don't talk, and you don't get it. <sighs> Write this down. Robert Kiefer, New York doctor. Pat Helberg, Chicago attorney, Bruce Capelli, Seattle advertising exec, all of them dead in the last 14 days, none by natural causes. Check it out. Hmm. Friends of yours? You get me in front of a grand jury. That's the deal.
I'll never give up on you. Mm. Let's make every second count. That was the first time I slept since I came back. First time since I didn't. It's perfect. I feel almost human again. What? I'm memorizing you. I'm gonna jinx everything if we ask why this is happening now. Mm. Things happen for a reason. Let's give ourselves a day to not think about it before we think about it. Deal. Why did you stay here, Eric? It was the only place I could feel close to you. I've been through so much. Why didn't you have it? Let's not do this. Not now. Let's just go out. Where shall we go? Anywhere. Everywhere. Mm. Okay. Mako, I didn't know you delivered. Yeah, well, this one's weird. What kind of blood do you think this is? How weird, Mako? You got bird blood here, man. Oh. You take a pile of dead birds just to cover a gravestone. If you're right. And there's some trace stuff in it, too. You know that uh, black carbon powder you turned up in September? You found some of that? Yeah, just a little mixed in. Anything else? Mm, I could probably narrow it down to what type of bird if it's important. No. No. You know what? It's okay. I'm good. Thanks. Just a minute. Done and out of here. Hey, thanks, huh? What can I do for you, darling? I know that I should feel good, but it just feels like more violence is following me around. What is it, darling? You haven't heard? Heard what? One boy's dead. Put that thing away. You don't threaten a risen crow with a gun. So true. So very true. You have something of mine here in this room. A little birdie told you, I suppose. I've already killed one man since I came back. I could go for two. You've tasted blood. That's good. But you don't want me. Why not? I created you. It would be an improper way to express your appreciation. Where's my crow? Let go of me. And I'll tell you. I have a favor for you to do. Then you can have him. Not interested. I wouldn't advise that. Kill the bird. Kill the crow. Talk. Well, that's the problem. There's this former associate of mine, a judge, who's doing too much of that. I need him found and retrieved. It's a simple task for your freedom. This was his. Do that thing you crows do. Do I look like a bloodhound? I need my bird. We work together. Pretty please. Remember, I raised you from don't think I can't bury you again. Next week, right? Come on, you tell you tell me that you're not gonna hire me. You're so thoughtful. What? You say promise me a job, man, and I I that's a qualification. Okay, I'll take that. 
soulmates. I felt that way even before we died. Now I know. Hey. Hmm? Maybe we never did die. Shelly. Whatever it is, just say it. We don't have much longer. How long do we have? We won't be together again in this lifetime. Would you like to finish what we started? More than anything. Check those names you gave me. Dead in accidents. Surprise, surprise. Doesn't prove murder. So, you got anything else you need checked by a cop? <sighs> the only thing I need from a cop is good aim and a fully loaded piece. Wrong. See, what you need is someone to believe what you're saying. Those names you gave me, they in the Lazarus group? How did you know about that? I got my sources. Don't forget this. Morrison works for Balsam. Who's got his own secret society? The Lazarus. Whatever. What kind of people would spend their lives becoming experts on death? Talking about the possibility of human to crow soul displacement. We may be talking about the Holy Grail, Frederick. Our reward will be immortality. <laughs> You just tell me what you know, all right? Because you don't have a lot of friends right now. Balsam made a successful body jump using the data from his experiments with Draven. And then he destroyed the technology. Now he's trying to destroy the people who know loose ends like me. Draven. Draven? If you can't say anything nice, don't say anything at all. What is going on? Hmm. Tonight we vow with candles as our witness to honor our heaven on earth. We aren't the same as others. We are forever lovers. We are always. I turned your poem into a song. I played it at the blackout. Like you were there. Like old times for a few minutes. Play it for me now. I changed a few lines. That's perfect. Two souls blended into one voice. I know you're in there. Come on, open up already. Man's always had unbelievably bad timing. Yeah. I'll lose him quick. Quick. Yeah. Get out of here. You can go. Troublemaker. Crazy, what's with the gun? Makes me feel better. 
What happened to you? You don't know. Know what? Where's Judge Morrison? Morrison? The judge from your trial. Albert, I have no idea what you're talking about. Put the heat down, it's me. Judge Morrison, the one who's a protected state witness, the one who you just kidnapped, that's who I'm talking about. Albert, I have been here all evening. Draven, I have an eyewitness. Yeah, or the line. Who? Me. What? You did this to me. Or the crow did, anyway. You gonna tell me you don't remember? Oh, man. What? I've been feeling weird, like, before it all happened. I've been hungry. I'm tired. I couldn't figure it out. Well, while you've been dazed and confused, people have been dying. Like fun boy. I didn't do that. Well, somebody painted a crow with blood on the wall above his body. And your grave's been vandalized with blood from a bird. Crow, I'm guessing. You tell me you don't know anything about that. I didn't kill Fun Boy, and I did not vandalize my own grave. Where were you last night? What? Last night, where were you? Do you have any witnesses? Maybe. He's not much of an alibi, friend. There's somebody I want you to meet. Dale Albrecht. Be Chili Webster. I know lie detectors are inadmissible in your court, so this will be our little secret. Also made a successful body jump. Destroyed the technology. I'm not the only bird. You got a stool pigeon. Ah! This thing is spawned from hell. You can't listen to it. JT, take him out back and make certain the evidence is at least six feet under. No! Be sorry. She's back on Earth. Shell. Take me to her. I don't know how to make sense of this. Got a theory. The crow is no longer part of me. It doesn't heal. So how can the crow be separate? The question is, what does it want? It wants whatever I would want if I didn't care about the consequences. Like you. She's in danger. Not just her. This crow is leaving a trail of bodies. It's my responsibility.
You two need to go someplace safe, away from here. No. Look, Eric, the truth is, this thing could blow up on both of us big time. You go with her. All right, you lay low till I figure this out. We'll hook up later. You need my help. You're just a regular guy now. You're only bound to make things worse. Go. Albrecht. You held my hand the entire time I was in the hospital. You were unconscious. Dying. I knew you were there. For me. Don't you go anywhere. of the Lazarus group. Yeah, I'm just gonna pay him a visit myself. Let's do it. I'm moving up in the world. Look, Eric, we gotta be smart about this. IQ is not gonna make a difference. Yeah, hey. Maybe this will. Can't see it coming to a gun battle. My fight's inside and you can't wait. That's yours. Drive it. this creature better than me. Yeah? So what's your plan? Look him in the eye. Tell him it's game over. Nice place. Not a bad reward. All I need now is my silk pajamas. Nobody is playing house and living happily ever after. Well, you'll grow to love me. I did. Real love. You're on a mission from God. Your boyfriend's resurrected. I am a crow. And you want me to get real. the way you think. No, I don't. Because I will never learn to love you. Rubies? You don't want to hurt her. Hurt me. How sweet. So, this is my Without him, you are nothing but a dark shadow. It doesn't have to go down like this. No. But it would be more fun. We're leaving. Get away from her. Or what? You'll kill me. How about I kill 
You, instead. Sounds risky. You came from me. I'll take my chances. He bleeds. And that's just for starters. You got some things from me. I got some things from you. Loser. Frederick Balsam. You're under arrest on suspicion of murder. Mr. Balsam is dead. Oh, that's right. An 87-year-old man who leaves his multi-million dollar fortune to his personal trainer. It's all perfectly legal? Well, it was bold, I'll give you that. Be seen around town together, establish the relationship, and then whatever unholy act that took the life of that young man whose body you now have. That's insane. You can't steal someone's body. All right. Then you're James Horton. Which means you really did set up the murder of Frederick Balsam. No. I got motive and I got opportunity. That's circumstantial. Well, if that one slides, I got four more murders to work on. Are you aware that as of this year, the state no longer has a death penalty? Now it's life in prison without the possibility of parole. And a man of your condition can live a long, long time. Don't go anywhere, handsome. Okay, I'll go with you, if that's what you want. I know why you came back. Enough! Just stop it. Just one more. Eric, stay down, please. sentimental. Eric! Than I thought. He's light. You were just darkness. Yeah, we'll get over it. Lifetime 1001 begins now.
No. It's right. It's how it's meant to be. Don't be afraid. I'll go with you.